So this is my new solar wireless camera. And this is my third, it's not, it's not my only, this is the third one I have like this. But I bought this one because it's the 5MP, and I thought, hey, look, this is an upgrade, brand new, um, and I need one more, so this will work. Now, uh, I've had the other one for a year now, or the other two for a year now, and they are absolutely amazing. I'll go over the battery and kind of the other features. But the main thing about this is it's not just a camera. It's also a uh, floodlight, and it has an alarm system built in. So if someone walks in front of it, the alarm system's gonna go off. It, it'll notify your phone that someone's in front of the camera. It'll record them and it'll put a spotlight. And if you if you turn the the alarm on, it'll start flashing and the alarm is gonna go off. And it, it's pretty loud. You can hear it. So um, I really like all these features built into it. But the biggest thing was I wanted a camera I could control and didn't have to worry about buying a subscription. Now you can. It offers a cloud service, but you can use a micro SD card. So I use the SanDisk Extreme, and this is the 128 gig. So I use that in this camera. It just goes right in the bottom here. You can see micro SD slot, and you can use any micro SD uh, card and it'll record it. But you can also use the cloud service, which on uh, one of my main cameras, I do use the cloud service, and it is, it is pretty great. But the app is really easy to use. I'm not gonna go into the app too much, but you can do things like battery management. You can select certain areas where it's a door or a walkway to really monitor. And then you can do the frequency. So if like birds keep flying in the camera, you can change it to um, the sensitivity. And you can change the, uh, there's one that's called humanoid detection. So you can turn that on. And during the day, if you have a dog outside, it'll, it won't really catch that dog. It'll look for that human figure. So that's pretty cool. That's a lot built into this little camera. Um, I've had other hardwired systems before, and th they're great and all, but this one's just a, a, a different type of camera. Also, I wanted to say that it doesn't record continuously. So it's not gonna continuously record on here. It does intervals. So if there's motion, it'll do a 10 second, 20 second, or 30 second interval, just which one you wanna pick. Now, don't worry, after those 30 seconds, if someone's still moving in the camera, it'll keep recording. So it'll do another recording, another recording. So amazing camera here, two-way audio. You can talk back and forth through it. Um, I've never had issues with the battery after a year of my other two cameras. This doesn't have to be directly in the sun. Now, they're gonna say it does, but um, I have two of them that aren't in direct sunlight all day, and I've never had a problem with the battery. Um, it, has to, it does momentarily get extended minutes or uh, hours of sunlight, but it's not directly in the sun all day. So I just wanted to say that, that it's pretty amazing how this keeps that battery charged. Um, but that's it. I mean, this great camera here. This is the 5MP and uh, I really like this company and everything, the system, the app, everything is really easy to use and um, it's pretty straightforward to get everything set up. But this is the solar wireless camera, the 5MP by uh, Rebloom.